Jelani, a couple hey, Jelani, weeks yeah, yeah, I just wanted you to lean into the mic. Please. Gotcha. Jelani, a couple weeks in a row now, you've made a play in the game. Just what does it feel like for you? Do you feel like you're starting to gain momentum here in your second year? Yeah, I'm starting to get the hang of it. I'm starting to get in the groove. Uh, I love making plays, so it's just been feeling good to actually go out there and make yeah. some. What was that fourth down play like at uh, Penn State? Nerve-wracking. <laughs> you guys were on the edge of your seat. I was feeling it on the field. Uh, <laughs> They say I have four catches in uh, one uh, drive, so I take the stats. At what point did you know that uh, you had actually finally caught it? Uh, when everybody tried to tackle me still. <laughs> what was it kind of like to see the reaction from coaches and, and your teammates on the sideline on the field when you made that play? It was still kind of surreal to me, so like seeing my teammates and stuff happy for me, it was just an amazing feeling to come back to the sideline, and it was basically like a party out over there. You what mentioned is, getting the hang of it. What do you feel like are the things that you needed to get the hang of to get to where you want to? I don't know. It's just I I just been in the groove. Uh, obviously, the last two games I didn't, had a catch, so I don't know. I don't know what's different, but I'm just out there making plays now. Was it frustrating earlier in the year that maybe you think you should be making a bigger impact? No, I knew my, I knew my time would come one day. Just got to make the play when it does come. Did you look back on it? That little juggling catch. You look back on it now. Well, you needed that. You understand what I'm saying? To yeah, I needed. Like I, I, yourself yeah, I needed forward. something to get me started. It yeah. was a little nerve wracking that it had to be that one, but I will take it. Yeah. And then last week that was a, almost a routine. Uh, you know, hands mm -hmm. over hands. Uh, so is that where you can go? Is that where you can get to, uh, Jelani, from the standpoint of being a reliable receiver? Yeah, just gotta look the ball, and if if it comes your way, you gotta catch it. Uh, routine catch. Trying to make some more. By the way, it did say did the defender tip that a little bit? You remember? I, I couldn't remember. It, the ball seemed like, yeah. I, no, I knew I mean, it was a little bit high, high just scramble, yeah. you know, make a play. So did you, what's it, what has gotten you to this point? Obviously, Will Kaczmarek caused a little bit of a need in that room for somebody to step up, right? Mm -hmm. His injury and stuff. But do uh, uh, you feel like this season is just getting started for you? How would you describe it? I feel like it's getting started for all of us. Uh, we got to win out in November. We got to come strong. We can't lose any more games. We got to win out. So everybody come with that A game. Will gave me a little opportunity. He's, he's coaching me up while he's recovering. He'll be back soon. Jelani, do you feel like you've made a big stride in the blocking department this year? I feel like I made progress uh, since I got here. It's just gotten better and better. Uh, right now, you guys are getting to see it. Jelani, what are your thoughts on you guys finishing the season with six straight noon games? Say again. Six straight noon games, ten regular season. What are your thoughts on that? Uh, it's good games. Uh, I, I really don't mind. 12 o'clock, we get in, get out. Have a good game. Get to lay on the couch after that. Watch the games. Do you wish you guys had more night games? I really don't. It really doesn't matter to me. I like playing football. Are you looking forward to playing in Wrigley Field? I mean, uh, you know about Wrigley Field, Chicago Cubs, et cetera. Just, yeah, of course. It, it, it looks like a great scenery going out there to handle business, play football, you know, watch them. Are you a baseball fan at all? Like, do you have a team? Nah, not really. I can't say I'm a big baseball fan. Really, football and basketball live for me. You talked about the injury with Will a little bit ago, just was there kind of a feeling in the room of like, you know, it's time for someone to step up, time for someone to you know, kind of help up when you lose a guy in that room? Of course, you need somebody to step up when you have somebody as big as a role go out like that. But I feel like he's been in, in my ear, everybody's ear. We knew we all we all came to handle a job. It's just time for me to step up now. He'll be back. He'll be ready to do his job when he get back. How involved has he been? Uh, very. If, if he can't catch me, he's in rehab, trying to get it right, trying to get back to us. So I, I feel like he's striding in a great way because they just said he's ahead of schedule. Can't wait to see him back on the field. Appreciate you.